Hi guys. As you can see this week I went to the salon and I plated my hair as you can see now I'm wearing it in a bun but you can also just leave it leave them free and wear the ponytail um, I am quite happy with how they turned out as you can see they made lines all the way up to here and then all of them come together and then they are like a ponytail. Um, so what I want to do today is tell you the benefits of plating your hair. And also I'm going to tell you the downsides of plating your hair. Um, first of all, I want to show you something. So I bought these before I went to the salon. Bought them myself, it's cheaper. You can also get them at the salon, but they will be a little bit more expensive. These are 55 Kenyan shillings, which is maybe like half a dollar. Um, so you have pink, you have purple, blonde, you have many colors. But um, these are the colors that I bought together with purple and blue, which you can see are in my hair right now. Um, and they are called braids. Which is weird, I think, because these are just hair. These are not braids yet, but they call them braids. Um, so um, I went to the salon. I told them what they what I wanted, and it took them around two two and a half hours to be finished. Um, it didn't really hurt me. Sometimes when you get home after plating, you hurt for like a day or two, um, but this time I it didn't hurt. So it don't think they did it that tight maybe they were scared that I would feel pain or something like that so um, but I'm really happy with the way that it turned out and I hope they can stay for long um, so on the good side what I like about plating my hair is that you don't have to wash calm or style your hair for a while so it saves you time that's my number one and then second um, is that you won't find all your hairs everywhere in the house and all over the floor anymore because um, my hair is very long and um, I normally find my hairs everywhere literally everywhere 
and it's a relief to not have that for for some time and the third thing that i want to mention is that me i like it to change my style um, without having to cut it or it being very definite like now i have some blue in my hair and some purple but i would never paint my hair blue or purple but this way i can still have blue or purple in my hair or pink and it, i know it will come out and then i have my own hair back so you can easily change your style every two or three or four weeks and um that's really nice on the downside it's quite expensive like i said you have to buy your own braids which are not very expensive but you still have to buy them and then um this cost me five dollars around five dollars i think um and we really had to bargain for that so it's quite cheap actually um but i have been plated for a lot more than five dollars um one time that was the first time ever which is more than two years ago it was sixty dollars sixty dollars which i think is crazy and then one other time it was even more than that so we don't even want to talk about that but back then i did i didn't think that was a big problem because i thought it was normal but it's not normal at all um but even if you pay five five dollars let's say every month that is um sixty dollars a year right well for me with my hair which is just long and straight and simple i don't go to the salon that often maybe only once a year or twice a year or ask my mom to cut it instead um, because um, then I don't have to pay anything at all so altogether this is um, if you keep doing this like all the time this is a really expensive way of um, styling your hair and the second thing which I think is uh, a downside to me at least is um this thing which i have shown to you before i don't know if you saw the video but um this is what you have to wear at night it works like this and then of course you have to put in the tail as well but i'm just going to show it to you what it looks like you just have to cover your hair because you want it to stay nice and i don't think this is very sexy actually i think it looks horrible so i don't like it at all but that's how i look at night um yeah so then another thing is that you can't wash your hair and then now you will say um you already mentioned that with your positive things well it saves time but on the other hand you know your hair gets dirty and you can't wash it because if you wash it it will start being ugly like really soon so you can't really wash it so at some point you know you feel like scratching your head or you know there's dirt collecting inside or um like hair start to fall, want to fall out because you know naturally your hair just replaces itself and you lose hairs every day but they can't because it keeps sticking here so they start popping out um so you really want to wash your hair and then you can't so maybe it doesn't smell very good or maybe it doesn't look very fresh anymore that to me is definitely a downside um, and it takes a lot of time to put them in and to take them out so going to the salon it will cost you a few hours and then taking them out cost you another few hours so yeah you save time every day because you don't have to calm it because you don't have to style it because you don't have to wash it but at the beginning and the end it's gonna cost you a few hours and um, well that's really going to consume your days that you're doing it so anyway those are a few of the things that i think are downsides or benefits of plating um i hope you liked this video i hope you liked me sharing this story with you and um, if you do like it please give a thumb up to this video subscribe to my channel for more videos and i'll see you again another time bye